So now let's look at some uh, other things here. Uh, I'll just go back to the screen. I'll close that text frame tab. So let me zoom in here. Now what I'm gonna do is go to my paragraph uh, panel on the right hand side and show a few other things that's available to you. So in particular, when you're working with um, uh, text frames with uh, columns, you might wanna have some control over the way that these uh, text frames flow. So for example, if I sort of get the text frame into that position, at the moment here, I've got this orphaned uh, first line of this, uh, of, of this paragraph here. So uh, one of the things that you've got under the paragraph panel is flow options. And here you can see there's various options that you can have. I can actually choose to prevent orphaned first lines. So that will just ensure that never happens. It will only make mean that at, at, at the least there will be two lines uh, of a paragraph before it kind of gets uh, separated. I could also prevent widowed last lines to make sure that uh, I don't get kind of a single line uh, of a paragraph appearing at the top. Or I could just do something simple like keep all paragraphs together. Uh, so now we'll only ever have full paragraphs uh, in, the, uh, in, the, in each column. Uh, so that's flow options. Um, we can also got control here on, on hyphenation. Uh, so if you want to add hyphenation to your columns, you can do that. And in fact, there's lots of advanced options about uh, uh, what the rules are for those hyphenation uh, uh, marks being, being included. Um, we've also got drop caps. So at the moment, I've got this whole text frame selected. I could enable drop caps here. So as you can see, uh, at the start of each paragraph, I've now got a drop cap. I can uh, change the height of that drop cap by the number of lines. So that's four line drop cap or down to a two line drop cap. Uh, I've also got control over the distance from the drop cap and I've uh, got an option to, to align the drop cap to the, um, to, to the left there. I mean, it's actually worth saying that, that all of these things I'm applying to the whole text frame. So it gets applied to all paragraphs, but you don't actually need to do that. So in fact, let me just uh, turn drop caps off for a second. If I'm actually in this text frame and I've just got some of the text selected from one of the paragraphs, so in this case, this top paragraph, now when I do enable drop caps, that's now just applying it to my first paragraph um, and not the rest of them. I'll just come out and select the whole text frame again. Um, and we've also got an option here for initial words. So this means that if you want this, the, the, the first uh, X number of, of words in each paragraph to be treated differently in some way, you can do that. So I'm gonna enable that. At the moment, it's set to the first three words, and I'm going to say I want the first three words to be bold or strong. Um, and as you can see now, in each paragraph, the first three words um, are strong, or I could increase it to, say, five words or whatever option that I kind of want there. I'll just turn that off. Um, and perhaps the final thing just to look at briefly is decorations. Um, so, in fact, in this case, let me choose this title at the top, and if I go to decorations, I've got various decorations that I can kind of add. In this case, I'm gonna add a line to the left of my title. Uh, so I'm gonna choose the left uh, decoration here. You see there's that black line there. Actually, I wanna change the stroke color there to um, the same uh, as, my, as my text. And again, I can actually control the, the indent of that decoration, uh, the, the width of it, to kind of get it looking um, as I want. And I might want to, at the moment, it's sort of going down to the descent of, of the text, but I might want to change that to say the baseline of the text. Um, and of course, just to say it with something like that, this is something that's picked up in text style. So if I was to go back to my text style now and update my heading one, um, you'll see that on all my other pages, let me just hide guides here, uh, on all my other pages, uh, I've now got that decoration added to uh, all of my titles.